Oh, you did? Hey everyone, it is Carol. I'm the creative owner at Be Inspired Market, and we are doing a really fun craft tonight. You're gonna want to stick around. So, my husband is watching comments. Say hi to Bill. Hello, hi Bill. <laughs> He's getting on here. Hey Karen, you guys are hopping on, hopping. We are doing a bunny um, tonight. We are making a bunny pillow out of a drop cloth and I've got a lot of things to show you. So hopefully you guys will pop on. Hey Karen, another Karen. Hey guys, we're super excited. We love these lives. So hopefully you guys will come, invite some friends. Hello Erica. Tammy, lots of you guys pop it out real quick. Jenny Good. Gerald is on. Oh, hey, Jenny. Hey, Carol Edison. Hey, how are you? Lisa, hello. Hey, guys. This one is, a, is it, there's a lot of, not a lot of steps. There's steps, but you guys can do this. I know you can do this. Um, so when I do spring, I love, um, I love bunnies. I made a bunny pillow last year. I just took a pillow and we put like um, little bunnies on it with their little butts and stuff. This one, we're actually going to make a bunny. Um, so hopefully you guys stick around. Sheila Stubbs, thank you for hey, the patches. stars. Oh my gosh, stars. Yay, thank you. So stars are like tips if that's what, if you know what they are. Okay, so we're going to start off. We're going to need a drop cloth. I got mine, um, I think... I don't know if this was, I buy either Amazon or Harbor Freight. So Harbor Freight, I think is probably a better price. Um, I think we got this from Harbor Freight. I think we did. Did you wash it? I didn't wash it. So this is just drop cloth and the one that I got was huge. So you're not gonna need that much, but I just cut a piece off and then I pulled out the iron and I ironed it just to kind of get the wrinkles off of it. Okay, so you need that. Kathy and Carol, thank you for the stars. Oh, thanks, guys. Hey, Joy and Lisa. Oh, lots of you guys. Yay. <laughs> What's today? Thursday. Um, okay. And your bunny template. Um, I'm really loving these. I'm making tracers. So if you guys didn't see the live yesterday, I had painted a gnome with Andrea from Birch and Stitch. Um, she's my partner with the shirts. And uh, I did a tracer. And so if you go to that post, you can print out your gnome and then you can paint it um so I did it for the bunny and the bunny is going to be like 17 inches so I just want to show you how to use the tracer um basically and I don't have it posted yet look for the post I will get this up there give me some time hey Charisse so Karen, hello and thank you for the stars and happy birthday oh Happy you birthday! We were gonna wish you a happy birthday yesterday, but we didn't. I didn't see you at least. So with the tracer, I told you it's a big bunny, but it's gonna be a really cute pillow. Um, so with the tracer, when you get it, when I get it posted, so you'll have to be checking back on the website. What you're gonna do is you're going to line these up, okay? So it's just a really simple side view of a bunny, and then. Cute shirt, cute shirt, cute shirt. Oh, thank you. It's in the market. Um, that wasn't a real good spot because you're going to cut right over it. But you kind of just, all you're going to do is tape your bunnies together, your paper together. So I'm showing you this process just because some might be confused when you print the, the, the tracer. So you're going to print it out on regular printer paper, okay? So it's not anything crazy. And it's going to print out in four sheets. But when you get it, look how big it's going to be. <laughs> I'm like obsessed with these tracer things and making them so huge. So I will get this posted. It's not posted yet. Um, if we're lucky, it'll be posted on the blog. Um, if you guys haven't checked out, we do have a blog. And we just have some posts that have to get up there. Um, Oh, love the bunny. Good. So this is what's going to be posted. So this bunny is 17 by, I don't know, 14 or something. So it's a good size bunny. Because if you're making a bunny pillow out of drop cloth, if you make it a little smaller, they're just harder to work with. And I wanted a big bunny. <laughs> um, oh, you bought the, oh, good, Kim. You bought the bunny shirt. I wanted to wear, we have a really cute, uh Bunny, oh, my mouth is dry. Bunny um, sweatshirt in the market. But I wore it yesterday, so. 
New Jersey is here. Welcome, guys. Okay, so Tracer is coming, all right? Once you get that, you cut it out, and then you have this really big bunny, okay? So fun. <laughs> I love this stuff. All right. Has anybody made a bunny pillow? Have you guys done any of that? And we're going to do a couple things to it. We're going to make it I have it a feeling cute. you're going to have a couple making bunny pillows, pillows. this weekend. Yes. And they're going to show us what they made. Don't you guys have, like, who's iced in? I've seen some pictures. Is anybody um, with the Kentucky. weather? Somebody Kentucky. Somebody iced in in Kentucky. So this is, if, and then, I mean, you could do this with any fabric. I'm using drop cloth, but if you have fabric in your stash, you can so do this. Um, so this is the drop cloth. Okay, I just cut it, and then I have it folded in half. Someone asked, uh, how did you prep the drop cloth? I didn't do anything to it other than um, I popped it in the dryer just to get some of the wrinkles because when you get it out of that wrapping, and then I just ironed it. But the drop cloth has that kind of vintage look to it. So. But this one actually, ladies, this one's soft. It's almost like drop cloth fabric. To be honest with yeah, you. Yeah, but it it's, is a drop cloth, and I can't remember. Yeah, I don't know. You must have got it from Amazon, because the Harbor Freight ones are cheap, and they're usually real stiff. They're stiff? At least until you wash them. Okay. So that's why I asked if you washed it. I'll check. So I'll check. When I do the, the tracer, I'll check to see where I got this. Because it is, like Bill says, it's softer than, like, your stiff drop cloth. It's almost like a curtain. Oh, Patches is iced. In Branson. Got a lot saying, I can't wait to get my bunny sweatshirt. We just rained in with cooler weather. Lori Stevenson. Okay. So I'm going to, I'm going to just take this. You can use stick pin or stick. I've done that where I've done the stick pins and stuff, but that's kind of prick yourself. So just tape it down. It's not real crazy. And we're going to go through both of them, so... Missouri's iced in, Texas Ooh. is iced in. We did, we saw, I'm sure you guys have too, those um, accidents. Accidents. Uh, accident oh, thanks for Texas. spreading the honey, Sherry. Prayers for all those families that were affected. Yes, that's, I mean, it is scary. It's, you know, um, we used to drive in that weather. So if you're new here, welcome. Miranda um, missed, where did you get the rabbit? If you want to explain that again while you're taping. So the here. rabbit I made, um, I made it into this large template and I'll be sharing that with you guys. But I just pulled an image off of, um, uh, what you call it? I use Canva. So Canva had a bunny and I just made it and then I made it larger. So you'll print it out on four sheets. So I'm just kind of getting my bunny down. Nothing crazy. Like I said, you if 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 this is not your cup of tea, cup of tea with um, the tape, you can definitely use you know stick pins. Is that what they're called? <laughs> and then you can just take your um, template and kind of like get it into the uh, drop cloth. Yeah, if you're new, let us know where you're from. We'd love to. Uh, Barbara's welcome, got some ice. Welcome you in. Yes, if you're new, welcome. Hit the video, hit my face. If somebody can please tell me how you guys can follow because I know Facebook has changed. I used to say hit my face and the follow button would come on and then I'd say hit the three buttons and the follow button would come on. Um, so I don't know what you have to do now. So I'm going through both of these, okay? I'm just, I'm going through both of my drop cloths. You're going real close to the pattern? I'm going as close as possible, yeah. So it doesn't have to be perfect. You're gonna, it's so big. I mean, <laughs> you can't tell it's a bunny. It's 17 inches tall, but I wanted it to be like, like big. <laughs> Pat Larson said it would be so cute to add some of those felt flowers that we made. Oh yes, that would be cute. We are gonna embellish her. I'm calling her her. How do you know? Um, because we're putting cute stuff on her. Oh. <laughs> So I'll get into the little corners once I get some of this taken off. But you could, if you don't want, you know, this kind, I mean, you could definitely make it smaller. You don't have to make it this size. I just think it's like a statement piece that you can put like on a cute little bench in your entryway. You can throw it on your couch. I don't know. It's hey just Deborah, something Hey, Deborah, thanks cute. for watching. 
She's new. Oh, welcome. And then Stephanie. We have a great group here. We Stephanie really do. Stephanie Labue said, it's still the three dots and hit the follow button. So oh, thank you, Stephanie. <laughs> if you're new, hit the three dots and then hit the follow button. It's, it changes all the time. That's the crazy part. Thanks for spreading the honey, guys. We do have a giveaway. Um, you can go to our website, beinspiredmarket.net. Go under the monthly giveaway and you can enter... Um, I don't remember what we're giving away this month. I think it's an Amazon card to two winners. So if you go to Be Inspired, you can comment link, and I'll give you the the links to all our stuff. Okay. We got a lot of women on here that have been through ice storms. Oh, we don't miss that. And it's crazy because, you know, we see everybody up north struggling with that, and then here we have Florida, like 80 degrees. And I'm not saying that to just... Say, oh, we have 80 degrees. It's just crazy to me that, you know, one part of the country could be like that. And then, you know, you go south and we're like the complete opposite. And my cuts are not perfect, but that's okay. It's not like, it's homemade, handmade, <laughs> whatever you want to call it. So you don't have to. I'm telling you, anybody can do this. And if you guys do it, just... Tag us in it on Instagram or here. Andrea said, touch Carol's nose, then the three dots, then follow. Oh, geez. Thanks, Andrea. <laughs> Thank you. It's crazy because I don't know. I'm off screen. Um, Facebook changes all the time. It really does. Okay. See how easy it just make sure you have good fabric scissors. That's what I've learned. When you get fabric scissors like these are from Joann's just use them for fabric don't use them to cut paper don't use them to cut other things because if you have a good pair of fabric scissors you're golden and well, if you're you just waving those around <laughs> hey joy joy howard feed the birds oh and it cracked it cracked under patches yeah with the ice patches is Patches his feet. Okay. All right. I got to get his, and we're going to make his tail all cute. I put a poll out for what you guys thought, but I think I changed my mind. <laughs> so we'll see. We'll see. Okay. So see how easy that was? You just have your pattern. You have your bunny. Look, he looks cute already. He's so big. I just love it. <laughs> I get all excited. Ah. <laughs> uh. Send some of that warm weather. Wish we could. I wish we could. Okay. Got to round out his little, which I could just do that. It's not a big deal. I'll show you in a second. I'm trying to keep them together. Right, Stephanie? She was waving those scissors around like... <laughs> Sorry. There was nothing. Thanks for the hearts, guys. So, again, you can make a whole bunch of pillows with your, you know, I mean, with your template. So if you wanted to make a whole family of bunnies, you can do that. You can use, like, they have really pretty, like, this would be pretty too with, um, like, floral. They have, like, a floral fabric or something. So see how, like, my edges were kind of not round. So I want to fix that. Did you guys that, um, all the ladies that have signed up for the texting notification, how'd that work tonight? I sent it out a little bit earlier, so hopefully you guys got it. If, if you got it, just respond with like a yes or something. Worked great, Bill. Yes. Oh, good. And anyone that doesn't have the texting and you're new and you want to be notified when we do go live. I made it smaller, but hopefully it's just as good. Mm -hmm. Eight, Bill likes the other one. No. No? Uh, you did a really good job with that. You eight, made that. 847-349-4477. You can get on our texting. And we text you when we go live. Okay. So now we have our bunny. So let's get our Tammy bunny together. Tammy and Bridget, thank you for the stars. Oh, thanks, guys. And I saw Sandy hasn't been on for a while. She's back. Janet Radley's on. Oh, hey, Janet. Hey, Janet. Worked great. Yep, got mine. <laughs> Perfect. Good. Okay. So now we have our bunny. I got my hot glue on. Put my tape away. So what we're going to do is... We're going to start, like, because he's so big, we're going to start halfway. 
okay? So you're just, now some people want to sew it. You so can do that. <laughs> oh, I get it. Sew it. Sew can do it. Sew can do that. Yes, yeah, so you can so do that. Um, I'm not a sewer. I'm like, <laughs> Taking off the iron today was like, ooh, what's that? I didn't so, even know we had one. Hot glue works just as good. And we're going to make, wait, are we doing him? Hold on, let me think. So Sherry Wolf asked also, I wonder if you could make it out of floral placemats at, from Dollar Tree. You totally could. You could. It would just be maybe a little yep, smaller. I'm trying to think what I'm doing. Hold on, let me think. I'm going to glue him first. I'm going to glue him first. Okay, I'm not going to glue him yet. Okay, let me, let me, I want to paint him, okay? Real simple. We're going to put like, like a faux grain sack. I'm not a grain sack person, but I mean like, you know, you do it. But we're going to, we're going to paint it. So if you didn't know, you can paint drop cloth. So. Do you need to put like cardboard between it or something? I have Lagoon. So it um, through the other side? No, because it's the inside of the bunny. So if it bleeds you don't through, think it bleed through the back. No, I don't think so. Okay. I don't think so. Okay, but we could do it. I didn't know. I didn't know if you wanted me to grab the cardboard. So yeah, we can do that. Where's the cardboard? Um, we don't have any here. Okay. Use well, the foam board over there. Um, you know what? Use I don't have my puppy pad. Hold on. Or use the board. It's okay. We'll do it this way. You're not gonna All be able right. to line it up, though, are you? Yeah, I'll line it up. Sorry, It'll be reversed. <laughs> we forgot the puppy pad. Okay, so let's paint this. I'm going to lay him this way because it's just easier for me to do that. And I'm going to, I'm just taking painter's tape. Let's see if we can do it. Like, it's like I'm thinking it. Patch just said, good idea, though. Better to be safe than sorry. All right, we're going to do, let's see how I'm going to do this. Paula said, oh, I had a nightmare last night, Carol. Uh-oh. I was back under writing mortgage loans. Who's that? Paula McCoy. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I'm still living that 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 dream. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna I'm trying to just figure out how I wanna do this. So that you can at least see what it's gonna be. Okay. So with a with grain tag, it's like you have one thick one and then you have two little side ones. So let me see two smaller ones. And I'm just eyeballing it, guys. It's what did you call it again? Like a grain sack pattern. Hmm. Have you guys heard of that before? Grain sack pattern? I've never heard of that. Comment. Let us know if you've heard of that before. I don't know. Okay. Grain sack. I'm going to go through here. Oops. And then this one's going to be... Okay, let me do that first before I get myself mixed up. Sure, so this is going to be so cute. Oh, good. Okay. Thanks for the start, Don. So make sure your tape is down. And then I have my lagoon, but you can use whatever color you want. And then I'm trying to see which brush I want to use. I'll just use my regular one inch brush. Nothing fancy. It takes, and I I don't want it. Like, if it's a little lighter in some areas, I'm okay with that. I like that weathered look, so it doesn't have to be perfect. Debbie said yes, and it's very popular this year. Oh, it nice. is. Awesome. There I am. Look at me be all trendy. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Mary, you're not late. We just got started. We just cut the big bunny out straight now some might ask are you you know does the chalk paint wash and all that anytime I do a decorative pillow I don't wash it I literally use it for the season and put it away I don't wash it there's nobody really messing with it um, and sometimes you know I just put it out the following year and it's fine so I don't wash my decorative pillows. Is that like a flower sack? Kind of, Julie. Julie McLee asked, is that like a flower sack? It's a drop cloth. It's a drop cloth. It's a drop cloth. And then Pat said, do you mean ticking material? I don't know what that means. No, ticking material is different. So ticking is um, 
has more of the thinner lines on it. Um, Grain Tech has like a specific style. It's it's a fat like um, stripe and then it's two smaller or narrower stripes underneath. And make sure you don't forget to go all the way to the top. So like I said, it's not perfectly solid, but I'm okay. Okay. Yeah, Pat just said she does that with season pillows also, where she probably doesn't. You don't wash or anything like that, because it's really, I mean, you just kind of put it out. Oh, thanks for spreading the honey, guys. 600 viewers and I sing to Karen, because yesterday <laughs> was Karen's birthday. She didn't get a song. All right, so I'm just trying to... On the floor. Oh, did it? Okay. This is a pretty blue. And the reason I chose it is because I had you guys pick out, we're going to put a little pom-pom on, on, on her little butt. Um, but I might use fabric instead. Okay, so let me see. Do I want to do... Thanks for the hearts, guys. Do I want to do one more? I'm trying to see. Do I want to do one more? No, because the, the other part is going to go here and then I might have some other stuff going on. So I think I'm just going to leave it, just going to leave it like that. If I don't like it when I'm done. Does it dry quick? It does dry quick. Yeah, because my little thing is going to go here. So yeah, I'm good with that. So I'm still putting like fabric and stuff. So see, this is what I'm talking about. See how it's got the thicker line and then the two smaller lines underneath or next to it, not underneath. Okay, so let's do the other one. Uh, Carmen asked, are you planning on uh, setting the paint with heat? No, not this time, right? No, no, you can. Let's see. So you're gonna want the other side. Am I gonna want the other side? It's gonna no, be you're sitting. Not gonna see it. You're not gonna see the other side. So don't even waste your paint. If you want it, when you plop, prop up a pillow, it's usually against something. So don't worry about that. Okay, I need to get wipes. But who else can we say hello to? Welcome, uh, guys. We have lots of you guys see. on. Oh, look at my. Allison's on. Gail Lynn uh, is on. Alma Mitchell is on. Debbie's on. <laughs> Rebecca. Uh. Carmen's on. I think we already said hi to Carmen. Teresa. Do you guys have any fun plans for the weekend? Anybody doing anything special for Valentine's? Do you guys... When's Valentine's? Sunday. Sunday? Sunday. Sunday. Bill received notification about 10 minutes before live. Oh, good. Nice. Which is nice. Okay. So. Not too soon. Okay. So that's good. I love the shape of this bunny. I do. Where did you get the bunny pattern, they're asking? Okay. Sorry, guys. I don't usually get a call, but I don't know if I went to a website today or something and literally have been getting a call from like an 800 number. Yeah, we lost a couple people. There you go. Okay. So I'm, gonna, back. so I'm putting the glue, but I'm not putting the glue all the way to the edge. And I'm going to do it in sections because your glue is going to dry. So I'm trying to work a little quicker, but I'm going to do her head first. And then let me worry about that. But you're going in about an inch or so. Nothing crazy. I just use hot glue. Okay. And then fold it over and lay it down. Brenda loves the stripe. Stripe looks cute, doesn't it? Welcome back, everybody, if we got blocked off. Brenda Dennis, she said, absolutely. I'm dancing with my hubby Sunday and sharing chocolate-covered strawberries. Oh, I love, love chocolate-covered strawberries. Oh, how cute is that? Muslim material that you're using. It's drop cloths, Annie. Drop cloth. Okay. So, this is big. So, what we're going to do is, before I glue the rest on, I'm going to get some polyfill in here all right I had no polyfill you can use pillows from Goodwill um pillows from Walmart this is like a filler like that kind of pillow so that's what I'm using so I'm gonna it's set a little bit and now I'm gonna go in here 
I'm going to try to get it up to the ears. And that's why I said it's easier if you don't do the whole thing because then you'll have room to really stick your fingers in there. So get as much polyfill in there and then we're going to take something. It's still a little dry. The what do you mean? Or wet. So let the, me... Uh, the bunny pattern let is a tracer it. and Carol's going to share that with you guys. Yes. So it's traced and then... You cut it out. So I'll provide you that tracer. It's a little wet, guys. Allison said, uh, where and what is the brand of drop cloth you use? Mine never looks that cream. I have to check if it was Amazon. I thought it was Harbor Freight, but Bill doesn't think so. But I'll find out for you guys. Oh, people are crafting for Valentine's Day. Nicole's here. Yeah, I'll find out. This one has a really um, cool color. It's not stiff. It's more like fabric. Uh, Diane said you can use a dowel rod or a stick to push the bedding yes. up into the ears. Yep, I'll be doing that. Saw so somebody's making brownies. Okay. Weekend of crafting. Oh. Making bunny, bunny bums this weekend. <laughs> oh, are you? Awesome. Okay, I'm going to try using a ruler. And we're just going to stick. So we want to get it. Let it. You got to use your fingers to kind of get it in there with the ear. Get it started. Get it started. Oopsie. And it's popping, but we'll fix it. No big deal. Oopsie. <laughs> Oopsie. <laughs> Oopsie. Karen said, I guess I'm making a bunny pillow now for a valley. <laughs> totally could. All right, let's get that in there. Do I have a doll? I have a doll. I have one. We'll use this. So that's why I said get the ear first before you start working on the rest of it. Well, at that point, when the, when the thing opened up on the side, just go into the side where your ring is. It's a straight shot. There you go. <laughs> Pretty smart. Pretty smart. Bill said it opened up. Maria said, my husband and I are doing a crafting challenge. Ooh, are you really? That's fun. I said that, like, seriously. I We do crafting challenges when we're in the club. Yeah. And uh, I always seem to win. <laughs> he, I thought I won this time, though. But then you came from behind and... Kimberly said, spending Valentine's with my three teenagers. I buy them sweet Valentine's gifts every year. And we go out to dinner the day before or the day after. For oh, that that's day. sweet. That's awesome. That's sweet. I don't, I'm, the girls are away at college. I don't, sometimes I send them stuff, but I did it this year. Got a lot going on. What would you do without Bill? Dinner with friends. Andrea. I know, right? Okay, so you kind of want to get it, see? how it's a little plumpy, that's kind of what you're looking for. So start with the ear, because if you do your whole pillow and then you go up to the ear, it ain't happening. So at least get that, and then I'll go in here and I'll hot glue. Oh, that looks so cute. Okay. So thanks for hanging out with us and spreading the honey. Vicky said, hi guys. It's hi, been a Vicky. while since I've watched you live. Happy Valentine's Day. Oh, happy Valentine's Day. Yeah. We're Never glad we when you guys back. come back. We might be back on. <laughs> okay, so let's get, let's make sure he's glued down. Hey, Patty Smith. Make sure he's all glued down. Okay. He's good. So let's do his head now. And then we're gonna make him cute. Still cute. Push that in. And you kind of want to make it, make sure you get it where it all. Yes, yeah, so there's another hole at the top, they said. Oh, is there? Yeah. Oh, thank you. Who was that? Let's see who that was. Nicole Richard. You must have really good she eyes. She does. <laughs> you have really good eyes. Thank you. Sheila Stubbs loves the stripes. The stripe makes it, and we're going to make it even cuter. Okay. 
Okay, some of it, I think I'm not letting it set enough, so let yeah, me... Yeah, Carol, Carol me, has a tendency to glue something and then go. Go, and then you got to let it set. It's not a big deal. It's fixable. Uh, Harbor Freight drop cloths are on sale right now. $22.99 for a 12 by 15. Amazon are $30 for the same size. Oh, okay. So... Harbor Freight, sure. I think the ones at Harbor Freight that are a little gritty, like a little stiff, I think you could throw them in the wash. And probably soften, and soften it up. up. Mm-hmm. Oh, you've missed watching us. Welcome. Or welcome back. Okay. Let me get this in here. Take your doll. Doll. Just no, I have not tried a tumbler yet. No. I still need to get some stuff. <laughs> He's got the, he's got some stuff, but he hasn't done it yet. Okay. Nicole said, I always have Carol's back. Oh, yes, you do, Nicole. Yeah, you do, Nicole. Thank you. You guys are all welcoming, everybody. We love that. We do have a great community here. Jen Cook is a newbie from West Virginia. Oh, Jen Cook. That's my sister-in-law's name. Or was. Um, not really. Jen was Cook. Jen okay, Cook. Not anymore. Not <laughs> anymore. Okay, we're good with that. Are you using regular so see, glue sticks or fabric glue sticks? I'm using regular glue sticks. I've used the fabric glue and I don't like it. It's gummy um, and I really don't find much of a difference. Lee said wash them three times from Harbor Freight and they'll be fine. Oh, perfect. Perfect. So yes, do that and then you'll have the right feel because you don't want it too stiff for sure. For sure. Okay. Patience. I don't have patience. Oh, Jody's welcoming all the newbies. Welcome. <laughs> okay. Okay. So now, are we good? Are we good? Yeah. That's we're a good. cool pillow. It looks vintage. Yeah. It's got a, and we're going to make it cuter. No way. <gasps> yes way. Okay. And now let's do the rest of the body. Okay. Thanks for the stars, Janet. But again, you're going to do a little glue. And then put it down. Patch just said, try the fabric fabric glue in the bottle. Oh, in the bottle? I didn't know it comes in a bottle. I do have something. Okay. Now, <laughs> I almost did it because I'm on a live. I almost went this way. You, you want to make sure you leave the bottom open because <laughs> then you're going to have one funky looking bunny. <laughs> uh, oh everybody's welcoming the newbies you guys are awesome okay let's go to this side if you're new drop a heart hit that heart emoji down there if you're new okay we don't have any newbies <laughs> they are oh, there right. they go there goes the newbies thank you <laughs> welcome uh, you guys are so sweet oh we got another one six by nine drop cloth at home depot or twelve dollars and eighty cents okay good that's good so like I said, you're just taking the glue, okay, and then leaving a little section on the bottom. So you want to work in sections. If, if you were to hot glue all of this, your hot glue would dry before you even got it to stick. And like I said, if you did the bunny and you were trying to get up to that ear, it would be nearly impossible. So do it this way. Oh, I see all the hearts. <laughs> Awesome. Okay, I'm waiting. I'm patient. I have no patience. Spreading the honey. Oh, hey, Debbie. Lots of you guys. <laughs> she That's listened. awesome. She'd be the skinniest bunny on the internet <laughs> if you glued the bottom too soon. Right? Okay. I'm loving that, that pattern, and I love the blue. So the blue I used was Lagoon by Waverly. Okay, is that long enough? Because I... Let's get it stuck, but we're still making it cuter, so don't go anywhere. Yeah, well, they got to see the finished right yeah. now. All you see is is upside down. And if the comments are in your way, swipe to the right and the comments will go away. Yeah. If you're watching from a mobile device, if you're watching from a desktop or something, I'm not exactly sure. So if somebody knows how to do that, why don't And when they you comment? take your fluff, sometimes it's bunchy in there. You can... Um, Get it all over the room. It's literally flying all over the room. You might as well just dump some glitter in there, too. <laughs> Honey. Norma love, love, loves the llama shirt. Oh, 
good. It's part of, um, we released our spring collection. So you guys can go check that out. We've got, there's a little hole. Um, we put out three shirts um, that another, you can grab. Another Oops. hole popped oh, in the head. Oh, thank you for the stars. Who was that, Denise? Another hole popped in the head. Popped in the head? What? 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 That's what you get for doing it live. You gotta have patience, Carol. Nobody is, in, are you guys in a hurry? Nobody's in a hurry. <laughs> Just be careful. Yeah, that, that glue is hot. <laughs> it is hot. That's why they call it hot glue gun. Tara's on. Hey, Diana, we're making a bunny pillow out of a drop cloth. And it's a big pillow. So, and I'll give you guys the tracer. Like I said, make sure you guys are following so you can come back to the page and get the tracer. It will either be on the page or in a blog post. Thank you all for spreading the honey. We appreciate it. Sprinkle, spread the honey. You guys know what to do. So when you're taking your ruler or something, you're just pushing it through so you make sure that you get that shape of the bunny. How is the kitty Lily? Well, she's she started this week to come in the craft room when we're in here. <laughs> yeah. In like Carol's craft studio. And she hides underneath like we have a table with like... I don't know, two or three cricket machines on it. <laughs> and uh, she hides under the table. And then it's kind of a pain to get her out. But Yeah. But she's fine. <laughs> Bill was like blocking it. I'm like, don't confuse her. <laughs> she's just going to go somewhere else. I'm like, just let her go there. I pull her out. So that's what we got going out so far. Look how cute. I love the size of it. I think that's what makes it is the size for sure. Okay. Let me... Yeah, Lynn said, don't worry, Carol, we're not going anywhere. Thanks. Okay. Here comes the hearts. Everybody do a heart. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody do a heart right now. Hit the heart emoji. <laughs> Just right. for fun. Let's see them all pop up. Okay, now I got to get his little foot. See how that is. And then... You guys are awesome. You can't see on your screen. Oh, yeah, you can. I can. See them all. You guys are cute. I'm counting. Okay, we're going to we cover. We have 509 people watching. There's, okay, we're at 200 hearts. You tell them. <laughs> you know who you are if you didn't hit the heart. All right, let's get this on here. We're still making them cuter. Okay, and that's why I said leave. See how you've got that edge? Leave that edge. It. Some people put it where they put the, they do the, the, whatever the design and then they flip it inside out i have no luck with that no matter how long i wait for that hot glue to dry it never dries and i always take it apart so this is easier for me just to put it this way so it looks like it has that like if, if i had stitched it i guess that's what i'm trying to sh say to you okay so let me just make sure buffy thank you for the stars jennifer thank you for the stars okay and then get it as close as you can to the bottom so it's filled. Okay. And then all you're going to do, make sure his little foot is filled. Oh, don't worry, everybody. Sheila Stubbs got everybody else taken care of that didn't hit the stars. <laughs> Sheila said she did 15 to 20 extra for people that maybe uh -huh. didn't want to hit the heart. Not stars, the hearts. You guys are fun. Uh... Oh, everybody Jackie saying... loves watching us. Thank you. Everybody's saying it's so cute already. All right, we're gonna make it cuter, okay? You are so gonna embellish this. I am gonna embellish it. You're gonna use your inspiration <laughs> and you are gonna embellish this. So hold tight. Now's the time when you wanna spread that honey. Share with your friends. Uh, okay. Get it, do it. All right. So cool. Yeah. <laughs> Carol Catches, Frost. Catches likes the uh, unfinished look of the sides. It looks more um, country, she said. Yeah, it's just, it kind of gives it that look like you stitched it, but you didn't stitch it. Like you didn't finish stitching it. Yeah. Like your grandma made it in a log cabin. And the, and the nice part of the drop cloth is the fact that um, it looks weathered. Okay, so I'm trying to... Make sure he's, she's, I call her she, all in. Okay. Whoa, Sandy Newber's so, on. She said, sorry I'm late. It was my mom's, my mama's 89th birthday today. Oh my hey, gosh, happy, happy birthday, birthday. to your mom. That's awesome. That's so cool. Okay, so again, 
you can, if you, if this is your, your style, you can be done. You don't, but we're not done. So we're not done. Hold we're tight. Not done. Okay. So, and I didn't even barely use a lot of the, the fluff stuff. Okay. That was an actual pillow. <clears throat> so now I'm thinking. We keep our old pillows. I'm going to make a little tail for her. I know I had posted we were going to use this or like the yarn, but then when I looked at it more, I don't know. I'm tr I'm thinking like a rag bowl with the fabric because I think the fabric is going to look cute. So we'll try it that way. If it doesn't look right, I'll go on to the to the other thing. I don't even know how to spell embellishment. <laughs> Like I said, you can stop right there if you wanted to, but you don't have to. So this is fabric. I got it from Walmart. So we're going to just... They're all wishing Sandy's mom a happy birthday. happy birthday. Yeah. That's awesome. What a great group. Okay, let me make sure I'm cutting the right way. Yeah. So I'm just cutting some strips. And a puppy pad at the same time. Yeah, and a cu puppy pad at the same time. Watch your fingers. You just get a whole bunch of strips. If you tear them. So, like I said, I was originally, I posted, and you guys were all like, like a lot of people like this. So, this might be backup. You know how I am. We'll try it. And if it doesn't look right, we have backup. Cute fabric for sure. Yeah, I was surprised at Walmart that they actually had some spring Oh, love so oh, somebody, Robbie loves the painting. From yesterday. From yesterday. Go to the video. If you guys sprinkle that video, somebody is going to win. We painted, Andrea and I painted that last night. So if you go to that video from last night, you can uh, just comment, spread the honey or sprinkle. And we're going to, I'm giving mine away and Andrea is giving hers away. So isn't that cute? <laughs> so much fun doing that last night. We'll do some more painting videos for sure. Okay. Probably have too much fabric, but. Okay. I love that fabric. My Walmart never has cute fabric, Sherry said. And these are fat. Um, I like the fat quarters. I really do. Oh, wow. You guys invited a lot of people. Um. So we're going to see how this works. Karen, I'm only singing if we get to 600 and <laughs> if you're still on, Karen. All right. So we got fabric. It's it's like a rag bow. So we're going to see how that looks. Okay. Tara said that was such a fun video yesterday. Oh, good. It was fun. It was definitely fun. Tina said, I also started following Andrea last night. You oh, guys my were amazing. So you, gotta hit. you guys were amazing. Oh, thank you. We had fun. Andrea invited um, us to to come on and paint, and it was it was a fun time. So we appreciate that. Oh, thanks, Janet. Okay. That's a lot of fabric. That's a lot of fabric. We'll see. So, I have this from Honey Hush. Honey Hush on Etsy. Heather, and I'm going to see if I could do it. You can use cardboard. You don't have to. I'm going to just take my fabric, and I'm going to just wrap it on here. And I probably have way too much fabric, but we'll see. They said my sides hurt from laughing so much last night. Oh, it was fun. <laughs> it was fun. It was fun. Is Karen on here still? We're getting close. Karen. There, oh yeah, come on, 600. <laughs> I'll see you, Karen. <laughs> so when you do a rag bow, you're just basically taking your fabric and you're wrapping it. I have, this is a pom-pom maker from Honey Hush Creations. Um, Heather has it on her Etsy store. Um, but you can use cardboard if you... Wanted to. Robin said the rag bow is perfect because it goes with the frayed edges of the fabric. That's what I was thinking. Thank yeah, you. The more I thought about it, like I posted that, I was like, and I really did want to know what you guys thought. But then when I started looking in the craft room, I was like, oh, I have this really pretty, which I probably have 
more fabric than I need. But I thought like the blue that's, you guys, this looks a lot bluer to you, but it's a little mm -hmm. more turquoise on my end. Four away, Karen, four away. Um, <laughs> and this fabric is really pretty because it has like the turquoise and the flowers. That's kind of like what I think of with spring. Oh, <laughs> Jody's saying happy birthday. These are awesome. Going the opposite way, Karen. No, it's not. Yes. <laughs> it's okay. We appreciate all, oh, no, just, just, all of you guys that are here. Oh, I'm starting to sweat. I haven't. You got to sing. I haven't sung in a while. Okay. Well, I'm just making a bow, so I don't know. Well, I'm not singing yet. We're not at 600. Yeah, mine, mine went uh, 600. Mine yeah. did not say 600, so don't try to. <laughs> 599. Ooh, I gotta get my singing voice. Um, he's gonna have one puffy little tail. And you can't go wrong with a bow, with a red bow. Ashley says, Hi, Mama. Hi, Ashley. Get to studying. It's my, da my daughters are up in I at ISU studying. One's finishing her master's, the other one's finishing her bachelor's. Super proud of them. Oh, thanks for sprinkling. Need the bright spring colors, right? Okay, let's see. So, it's better to make it puffier because you can always trim it down. Where did you find the pattern for your bunny? I made the pattern, and I will I will be sharing it with you guys, whether that's on the blog post or here on the page. So just keep checking, um, and I will post it for sure. Okay, 700 and I'm singing. Honey, you can't do that. <laughs> <laughs> you can't do that. How upset did all you guys just get right now? I did. I was I'm, like... I, why did you get upset? <laughs> I'm not singing to you. I'm singing to Karen. I know. Well, go ahead. 600, Teresa. Happy birthday to Karen. Happy birthday to Karen in Clearwater. <laughs> Happy birthday, dear Karen. You gonna sing with me? Happy, Happy birthday, birthday to, to you. you. <laughs> I hope you had a great day yesterday, yes. enjoying your birthday. I think you said you you enjoyed it with your grandkids. So uh, you guys are so cute. So much fun. What do you got? Seven hundred. I sing again. <laughs> okay, so now I'm gonna just take. My dude. And we're going to really hope. I just woke the dog up. Did you? Oh, yeah. She's like, what is going on? Okay. So now let's. Sandy loves your crafts, she said. Oh, thank you. Okay. Honey, I need your finger. Oh, I'm not getting on the camera. Okay. Well, you got to. Okay, well, I'm just going to do this. All you see is a finger. <laughs> Hold it down, please. Okay. I'm a finger model. <laughs> okay. Okay, I can't get my finger out. <laughs> it's not funny. It's got to be tight. Okay. So there's your, your bow. And then, so like I said, you can use cardboard, but go check out Heather's site. Now you're just going to stick your scissors... I said you gotta have good scissors. See, look what happens. I sing and then <laughs> everybody the, the views go up. That's I know. Awesome. I agree, Sheila. Don't I, give up your day. I'm not, I promise. <laughs> we love Sheila. Yeah. Her and Bill have so much banter, it's not even funny. Alright, so just get your scissors in there and you're just cutting it. One apart. of these days, if I ever make it up to Nebraska. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that would be so awesome to get to meet all of you. We have talked about that. That would be, I said, get the RV and start start going. We thought about it, and then COVID hit. Yeah, <laughs> COVID did hit. <laughs> COVID still Love hit. Love your shirt. So the shirt, you guys are asking about Carol's shirt. The shirt Carol is wearing is in her market. It is beinspiredmarket.net. You can find that shirt and some others in the market, so... Okay. After the live, go check it out. So you gotta like oh, shake it no. out. What? That was just fabric all over the place. 
No, it wasn't. Yeah, it's full. Shake it again in front of you and look in the light. Look at, there you go. So you just want to get your fabric just all. Karen said, are you able to make that pom-pom without that tool? Oh yeah, just use, um, just use a piece of cardboard. So when you do it with cardboard, so just imagine this is a piece of cardboard without this hole in the middle, just wrap it around and then you'll slide it off. It's just a little harder because you got to get your, when you do the pom-pom, you have to get your jute around the whole piece. So that tool just makes it easier, but you 100% can do it with, um, with uh, cardboard. I'm just a gadget queen. You guys don't know that. <laughs> Okay, look how cute that is. And it's better if you actually use the fabric that's like two-sided because then you get it, it looks a little better. But this works just yeah, so fine. so much fabric in there, it still looks great. Yeah, it looks really cute. Okay, let's make her all pretty. <laughs> fabric for days. <laughs> We can make, come back for more because we'll be making another pom-pom something. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, and look at that. I made it like the perfect size. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Crack myself up. She said I love that. Okay. Okay. Take the jute. That bow is absolutely adorable and perfect. So for cute. I, I do. I, again... I know you guys were choosing, but I don't think that this, like, I think this just goes better. Well, the fabric, I think. Yeah, it's the fabric. If you were using, like, a cotton or something, yes. maybe this one, you know? Okay. This one? Yes, I like that one for free. Okay, let me cut some of the jute. Play with it a little more. Am I going the right way? I'm trying to see where the most fabric is, like, where you can see the colors. I think it's that way. Kim asked, Kim said, hi, Carol. I haven't watched you lately. Kim, where, first of all, where, where, have you, been? where have you been, Kim? She said, you look great. How much weight have you lost? Hmm. The question is, how much weight have I gained? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, though, Kim. <laughs> Thank you. You are perfect, Carol. <laughs> Thanks, Sherry. Uh, a fluffy bunny, bunny bum. bum. Yes. Okay, make sure that... Patches in her bums. <laughs> making sure it's glued on. to make sure that looks super cute yeah Lori Stevenson said fabric is better yes look how cute that looks so far see look how cute and then if you want you can take jute you can wrap jute around the neck and make a cute little bow a leash? you can make a leash because jute and um, and drop cloth go together see I have something else but I'm gonna see if we're gonna a do brand it. new glue gun at the thrift store now that is a win-win that's a win-win for sure that doesn't happen so you got that look how cute should we add flowers well, you could just tuck a few in should we add some color. flowers I have some color. tulips do you guys I don't know think if they're the right color but I'm not a good judge of that I'll cut that off do you think we should add a flower tell me Flower, no flower. So stinking cute. Uh, <laughs> Robin said, so cute. And I think it think? was perfect with the one stripe. I think if we went with more stripes, I one, I would have got confused. So cute. So what do you guys think? Flower or no flower? Maybe if they were different color. Maybe um, the pink. I don't know. I have a rose. So you guys can tell me. I'm waiting. Karen can't wait to make this. No, no flower. Miss Bunny is so cute. Tim yeah, said no, no. No flower. Oh, hold on, it was just one no. Oh, sorry. Awesome as always, Kim said. Yes, flower, Jennifer said. Hold on, Laura. We're waiting. We'll see what else we got in there. I just think those don't look like the right color, but it, they sh they shoot spring. Debbie said no flower. Um, felt flowers. Oh, felt flowers. Carol would said. Be cute. Yeah. Love it, so cute. Felt flowers. No yeah, flower flowers. Needed. No, no flower, flower needed. needed. Okay. 
good. I'm glad I asked you guys. So yes, I think with the jute and I think the little bunny butt, how cute is that? So like I said, I'll be sharing the the template with you guys so that you can make it. Because he's a, she's a good size. I've been calling her a she. She's 17 inches by 14. So she's a very good size bunny. But you guys saw how easy it was. Felt, unfelt. Drop cloth, some um, pillow, some fabric. You can do any color you want. You don't have to put the stripe on. You can keep the stripe off. They're saying pink flower. Hold the pink flower up again just to see. Let me see. It's a rose. A rose, yeah. They're kind of saying... Ooh, the, the rose pink. is kind of... Yeah, because they're saying it goes with the tail. Because you have the pink in the tail. Ooh, that was... Yeah. Who said that? We're going to look that up. Who said that? Who was who okay. was that? That's a good... Who I think I agree. That? Dane Carroll, another great craft. Pink flower. Cute bunny. Pink flower is better. She looks Yes, better. I think the pink flower versus the tulips. You guys are awesome. Carol. Hmm. Tulips in the garden. Tulips in the park. park. Tulips. All I want with you is two lips in the dark. <laughs> Isn't that great? I just surprised her with my Valentine's Day poem. Okay, there we go. Okay, that's so cute. So cute. I love the rose. Yeah. Oh, perfect. Good. See, that's what I love. You guys help too. So if you guys make this, make sure that you tag us on Instagram, hashtag beans by your market. Come back here. Make sure you guys come back. Get on our texting, 847. I'll give that to you guys again. Oh, thanks for all the hearts. Snap it. 847-349-4477. Get on our texting um, so I can let you know when the template's available, whether it's on a blog post or on the page. Um, oh, Pink Rose, good. You guys are awesome. Oh my God, all the hearts. It was so fun. I was kind of worried. I was like, we're going to pull this off? And we did. So I'm super excited. I missed the tail. What is it? It's fabric. Show so it's them. like a, a fabric pom-pom. Well, or this. Like, yeah, just this throw fabric. it up in there. Kind of like let it go like So that. we use this fabric. What's from it called? A fat something? Fat, fat quarter. Fat quarter. Fat quarter. Fat quarter from Walmart. So... Oh, she's beautiful. Yeah, I kept calling her she. Oh, good, Melissa. Somebody said, what would it look like with the flower up by the ear? I don't know. I thought about it's that, kind of too. Like idea. a little crown. Yeah. Well, not just moving the one you moving. have. Moving. Not adding I already glued one. it. No, I'm But that's a good idea. So, no, they're just, it's just <laughs> ideas. <laughs> Very cute. Good. Oh, Karen said, thanks for the song. You are so welcome. Another great night. Good. All right, guys. Well, we are going to hop off. Hop off. <laughs> <laughs> I get it. Crack myself You're up. so funny tonight. Um, my so, cheeks are hurting. We you're had so funny tonight. I know, I am. Um, we had a good time. So I hope you guys enjoyed it too. Um, go ahead and um, come back. And we would love to see you. So we'll Jennifer, be back on. It was a drop cloth. That's the fact. We are actually on tomorrow on Essential Stencils page. So look for that and I will uh, let you guys know. But we're going on at 7. Central, 8 Eastern. <laughs> All right. Bye, guys. We'll see you soon. Bye, guys. Be safe.